Hey friends, Steve Guttenberg here and I am the Audiophiliac. So, you know, my question today is, is there such a thing as a universally agreed upon horrible sounding speaker? Well, let's say universally agreed upon by audiophiles and not truly universal, just like a lot of people really think so. Now there is one for headphones and uh, I'm going to talk about that one very soon and I want to reveal my choice, but uh, it's one everybody's heard. That's my hint. But as for a speaker that's been heard by a lot of uh, audiophiles and non-audiophiles that people have, let's say, disdain for. Now, okay, I know what some of you are thinking, Bose. Now, uh, you know, maybe, I mean, the Bose 901 isn't to my taste and maybe not even to a lot of audiophiles' taste, but lots and lots of people really like it and they've been liking it for a really long time. So. I'm not sure I could go with the, the 901 or any Bose, really. I actually, I used to own a Bose speaker too, actually. Bose 501s, and this would be probably in the mid-1970s. So I, uh, I admit to being a Bose owner, not for very long, but I did own Bose. So anyway, um, I don't know. I don't think there is one, but you guys can feel free to nominate your choices of worst sounding speaker. And again, it can't be an obscure speaker. This is a speaker that's you know pretty common that a lot of people have heard. Uh, feel free to uh, make those nominations in the comments section below. And uh, that's it. But anyway, I'll do the headphones soon. The universally agreed upon, and again, not truly universally agreed upon, bad sounding headphone that a lot of people have heard. Anyway. Um, if you like these YouTube uh, videos, please subscribe to my channel, come back often, share them, and I'll see you again right here very soon.